I'm not a social media person. Okay, but have yeah. you ever insulted somebody on social media? Yeah. Maybe one, which set, you've, you've insulted somebody on social media? I've done that, I've done that. Who did you insult on social media? Uh, the, like, like those musicians, like uh, David Doe. Why did you there? insult David Doe? Mm, you know, I'm a David Doe fan, and uh, so the way you do things, we don't, this is baby mama of things, I don't really like it. I'm not going to do like this. Would you call the cops? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hola, 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 what up, people? How are you all doing? This is your girl, Rachel M.M. Isaac, and yes, you can call me Ray Ray. We are out here to talk about a very, very, very interesting topic today. Today, we are talking about cyberbullying, yes. You know all those things that you cannot say to someone face to face. You go behind social media pages, and then you run your mouth, or you do your thing. Yeah, that is what cyberbullying is about basically so today we are asking have you ever been cyber bullied have you been like a victim of cyber bullying or cyber harassment or internet trolling what's your take on cyber bullying i disapprove of it i don't think it's a good thing now cyber bullying is like people's hanging behind their phones and judging a case they don't even know nothing about you just see a story or you hear a story and the next thing you're going, you're typing, you're abusing people and you don't know what that does to some people. Sometimes it leads to depression, it leads to so many things. Okay, I just think people don't mind their business. I don't see why people will just go on people's page and start bullying them. You just stay on your own lane. People are living their life the way they want. So I don't think it's right for people to go to other people's um, social media pages and start bullying. It's very wrong. Uh, Cyberbullying is what I've been involved in, actually, also. So wait, did you bully? Yes, I did. Ah, you had the bully. You bullied someone. Yes, yes, but um, I did it just a couple of times, like twice. Okay, so what did you do? Oh, you even have numbers. At least you confessed that it was more than once. Yeah, actually. Okay, so what exactly did you say? How did you bully the person you bullied? Right now, I can't even remember, but I know I've done it a couple of times. But if, if you actually, if the person actually sees you and they say, Ah, I know this guy. He bullied me. What Would they be wrong to actually physically assault you? Would they be wrong to actually get you arrested? Actually, I, I didn't do something quite extreme. I just um, more like... Exp uh, expressed myself, just no, I just in a very nasty way. Yeah, just I'm saying, let us know the extent to which the nastiness happened. <laughs> I think uh, the person put up something and it was actually, I, I didn't quite agree with it, so I was just like, okay, w why are you doing so? I just expressed myself, I didn't really, really, really attack. Both times that was what happened, yeah. So, you don't need any police for me, I mean. Justifying the fact. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> freedom of speech. Remember but, but freedom of speech. Actually, actually, cyberbullying is bad. Actually, I, it's, it's not actually something you should do because these people are humans too. Do you understand? I've I've gotten that shot too a few times. Been bullied too. Yeah, I've been bullied. So, but I feel it's not. If you take it to the extreme, it's actually bad. But at the same time, sometimes you just want to like cause some drama online, express yourself, and say some little things which could. Be, you know, fun. Uh, well, it's bad. Any form of bullying, either cyber bullying or physical bullying, is it's bad. And one one thing we need to know: if anybody is being bullied, any bully is suffering from low self-esteem, so they need help. Yeah. Research has made us to understand that if you see a bully, if someone bullies you, look. Let's look at. Let's take high school for instance. When we're in secondary school, those bullies want to. They want to show you, force themselves on you, show you that oh I'm like this is because they have a low self-esteem so if I see a bully I help him I help him with his self-esteem I, I bring him up someone insults you on social media you know you're one of those people that will say it's okay I know that your problem is it but God does something 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 what would you do it's not a matter of God for instance let, let's let's look at someone says my head is big is my head big? Will, will that make the size of my head increase we need to understand but is your head big though huh? If of it, all the things you could come out, someone never said your head is big. When I was in secondary school, they've called me all sorts of names. You felt bad then, right? Oh. No. Nah. You see, you need to first understand who you are. If someone says you are poor, does that remove the money in your, in your account? If someone says you are rich, does that add to the money in your account? So no, it we doesn't. Need to, we need to start understanding things like that. Then, cyberbullying or any form of bullying won't really make a difference. That's, that's my opinion. Have you ever been a victim, aside that time in secondary school where they called you Big Head? How recent? Anything of recent? Uh, nobody can bully me, honestly. <laughs>
nobody really uh, you can give to you don't also bully people she goes like no we all are unique and good and different in our own way so i don't need to force myself on someone if someone sees me good enough to be respected i will, I will comport myself in a way that I will earn people's respect, not force myself to be respected by people. If I see you judging someone tomorrow, you, I mean, come on, you don't know the person from Adam. You don't even know their story, you don't know what happened, you don't know anything. But you're just concluding, it's unfair. I tell you, it is unfair. But have you ever insulted any celebrity on social media? No, 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 no. I'm not a social media person. Have you ever insulted somebody on social media? Maybe what? Which set? You've, you've insulted somebody on social media? I've done that. I've done that. Who did you insult on social media? Uh, the, like, like those musicians like uh, David Doe. When Why did you insult David Doe? Mm, you know, I'm a David Doe fan. Uh, so the way you do things, you don't, this is baby mama of things. I don't really like it. Like to me, it's, it's not treated them well. It's being biased to some of them. And uh, there was a time I insulted him so young. So you insulted David Doe? Of course, because he's my fans and I'm not someone, the way he does his things, I don't really like it. So what would you do now, Will? I want to ask you a very honest question. If you go to a place and you see David Doe, and David Doe recognizes you as that guy that insulted him, and he has 10 bodyguards and he tells them to deal with you or do something, would he be wrong? <laughs> mm, although... I I might deny it, you know. I might say it's someone else. It shows your picture. I know you. Says your name. What would you do? You know, on social media, so many things happen, you know. I might say I'm not the one. Someone is using my pictures, you know. I can't really say it because I don't like having an issue with people. You are insulting them on social media. Uh, no, it, no, it's because he's one musician that I love so much, you know. But I don't love the, his lifestyle. But I love his music. But I don't really love his lifestyle, you know. So... To avoid having an issue with people, I have to let a social media out of my life, you know? If not, you keep insulting everybody. I'm someone that have a hot temper, you know? So when you have hot temper now? So now if you look now, they don't insult, um, impregnate another lady, you will insult him again. So because of that, you... Just, but what are the yeah, things you yeah. said to David though? What are the things you said? Let's even know if it's insult or are the ones just taking it too far? No, just like a guy, I don't like the way you do your things. Those baby women are not treating them well. I think you should get married and settle down with one. To be having babies with different women is not a good idea to me. So that is the way. That is just the thing I say. You know those musicians, when you tell them the truth, they will, so, so they won't take it. I say, I don't know what to say. That's not good though. Of course it's not. Have you ever been a victim of cyberbullying? Not really, but I have a friend. I have a friend that um, has been a victim of cyberbullying. Yeah. And it really affected him. Actually, the truth of the matter is, uh, funny enough, when you see that person bullying you on, on the internet, you might chip for him or her. That's the truth. Okay, okay I, think, I, I think I've been through that. Last year, I met the guy, I was like, is this you? Your words are different from your look. You look more. Yeah, you, look. <laughs> you guys insulted each other on social media. How did you get to meet? What happened? Well, I can't really say that. Ah, no, and that's a story, Fua. It's a birthday. Oh, okay, at the birthday party. Like, that is you. I was like, yeah, that is me. And what? this is you. So, funny enough, I actually got myself to prefer you. Okay, sometimes back, it's actually on Facebook, I posted pictures and people were liking it. Someone else was like posting something else on it, you know. It's just like being jealous, you know. You, people are, yes, now people are looking good and you just have to spoil the little things that they are they haters. Hating. So, people don't mind their business and they, they should just learn how to mind their business and that's all. No, I'm someone, I don't really believe in social media things, you know. I don't, I'm not into social media things because... I don't really believe in social media. There are so many things that happen there. It's just, it's just a normal thing. I was once on Instagram, but I have to block my account. Why did you block your account? I don't really like I'm not a social media person. So just, just imagine that someone cyber bullies you and then you go to an event and meet them there. What would you do? Walk up to them or just ignore them? Or ignore them. I ignore them. I think it's because that's something really nasty about you. No, I wouldn't meet them. To me, it's immature. What if I go there and then it's they empty? They beat you. You know, I'm, I'm very tiny, I'm very tiny, no beat me. <laughs> I would probably confront them, but I won't go to the point of getting physical with them. Like, getting, you know. Just making known to them, I know who you are. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, I'll just explain to them that what they did wasn't right. 
Baba assault shouldn't, you know, progress to physical oh, no, assault. assault. Yeah, no, no, Take no, no, out no, no, the verbal no. and physical <laughs> honor assault. Because I can express myself. I can't be arrested for talking, but I could be arrested for being physical. You cannot be arrested for talking. So you cannot be arrested for that. I don't know. Like, <laughs> it's good to just advise them not to do that because it's very wrong. They can also do that to them. I believe they won't like it. You just advise them. Advise them and talk to them. When you finish advising them, you walk away. You walk away. Sorry. Wow. All right. That's very good. Thank you so much. This is the much you can take on the show today. Do let us know what you think on any of our social media pages. Just go in the comment section and let us know what your take on cyberbullying is. Especially the part that says, what would you do if you meet the person who's been cyberbullying you? Would you physically assault them or simply ignore them? Okay, my name is Rachel M.M. Isaac. I'm your girl Ray Ray and I am signing out. Bye guys.